we're about to head on to the Great Ocean Road. Um, I'm sure a lot of you watching this will have seen or heard about the Great Ocean Road before. Um, we're not going to do the whole thing, but we're going to do a fair bit of it and go to the historic landmark, which is the Twelve Apostles, although it's not Twelve Apostles anymore, it's like 10 or something or not. We are two minutes away from Bells Beach. I mean, I think we're pretty much here, I can't lie. There we go, look. look Bells that. Beach Surfing Recreation Reserve. So this world famous surfing place. Nice. It's a nice area. It is a nice area. Look at that. Already got a lot of surfers. Yeah, nice. It'd be nice to see someone catch a wave. Beach. Yeah. There you go, world famous Bell's Beach right there. Cool as. Well, it's like road works, mm. but it's someone holding a stop sign rather than lights. And we don't really get that in the UK. In the UK, it's normally just lights left there for weeks. <laughs> yeah, so you basically get a geezer. He's got a big lollipop stick and it's like a, a stop and a slow. We'll go past it now. Just like, like, have a little film. Give him a little wave. Mm -hmm. Cheers, bro. Thank you. But there you go. And then he <laughs> sticks it back to stop. There'll be a person at the other end as well, past this corner somewhere. I don't know where the uh, things are actually going on. Here they are, look on the left. Look, see? Right. So yeah, it's like all done by people. It's, it's so weird. It's so weird. We had that in New Zealand too, yeah. to be fair. Yeah. Just thought we'd tell you, just show you what happens out here. They don't use lights, nah. So about an hour drive into the Great Ocean Road. What do you reckon? Yeah, it's really nice, isn't it? Yeah. I'm having to drive really slow. Like, I'm probably, I mean, I'm in kilometres an hour here, but I'm probably doing about 30 or 35. So it's like, you get to see it. Yeah. You've got no choice. Yeah. Um, but it's, yeah, it's quite windy, quite bendy and all that sort of stuff. But yeah, it's really nice looking out over the ocean. Haven't seen any whales, have you? No, I haven't. No whales, no dolphins yet, but we might do on this journey. Um, but yeah, it's just really good to be able to take it all in. And we're gonna stop at the uh, Great Otway National Park, sort of, uh, there's a lighthouse and on that road, uh, they've got koala bears in the trees mm. so we're going to try and have a look but we're going to do that for a main channel video so we'll show you there but might not show you a koala who knows check it out all right you lot we are out in the aussie bush in the cape otways looking for koala bears Yeah, nasty. Don't want to fall in there. Dirty. Where are the koalas? So we've left the koalas. We didn't see any, sadly. Sad. Um, and we're now on our way to the 12 Apostles. Yeah, shame about the koalas. Got a leech on my leg though. Yeah, a big leech. He's a big, massive bastard. Like, he was colossal. Was I honestly thought it was a snake. Like, I was looking around for a koala, and I was like, what's that on my leg? I felt something like slimy, 
I was like, oh, oh no, I panicked a little bit, shook my leg, looked down, massive black leech. It was disgusting. It was rank. It was massive. Yeah. So yeah, 12 puzzles now. Yeah. A little bit of sightseeing, should be quite nice. We're going to try again for quarters a little bit later. Hopefully find some. Yeah. Should we go see some rocks and that? Yeah. Wow. Oh my god. Yeah, that's wicked, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. That is class. I mean, it's taken like four or five hours to get here, and that's worth it. So worth that's it. definitely worth it. <laughs> that is unreal. Oh my word. <laughs> it's like better than you expect, isn't yeah. it? It's, I know you can see like Google pictures of it, but when you actually see it, it's unreal. That's sick. All right, everyone, how are you doing? Welcome along back to Animal Anomalies, and this time we're at Broad. Okay, that's number one, sorted. That thing is absolutely colossal. It's just taken off in front of us on this road, straight over the car. I could not believe the size of it. Kind of want it to fly for you. I swear to God, it, the way it took off over the road. <laughs> it was absolutely mad. Straight up there, wedge-tailed eagle. As oh. if it's just landed in front of us. Honestly, I might get the long lens out. Get it out, Hopefully, yeah. yeah. And see if it flies. Oh, mate, it looks wicked. Does it look really cool? Yeah. Look at that. Look at his head. He's big, man. I can't believe he just flew in front of us like that. Honestly. I can't believe he just unreal. landed there. Are you happy? Yeah, that was, that was pretty special. I can't lie. How big was that thing? It was huge. Wasn't it? Yeah. Like that wingspan must be wider than the car. Those things, one of the biggest eagles on the planet, the wingspans can get up to like two and a half meters or maybe even more than that. I think the biggest one was like 2.7 meters. That is colossal, massive. It's sort of weird looking as well. They look like a white-tailed sea eagle crossed with a red kite because they get the name wedge-tailed eagle because their tail is very similar to a red kite, how it sort of like um, comes up and that. Sort of like a trivial pursuit wedge. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> That's their tail. Um, oh, We're just driving and it just, just flew over path. us. Yeah, it was massive. Mate. Cool. Unreal. <laughs> Let's go and find some koalas. Yeah, we've got to do that quick. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Guys, look at this. We've got an echidna just at the side of the road. Look at that. Oh my word. We're just driving back to another koala bit and we've, uh, Kate's just spotted this uh, young looking echidna on the side of the road. So we thought we'd pull over and stop. Like we're not in a very ideal situation, I can't lie. But we've got this little fella. Oh look, he's balled up. Look at him, what a spiker. So that was the best thing I've ever seen in my life, <laughs> ever. Oh my God. That's cool. I mean, we're getting later and later for the koala bears, but yeah, <laughs> it's right. so worth but it. That's, that's, I think that might be the first one I've ever seen as well. Oh, yeah. Um, definitely yours, isn't it? First one I've ever seen, and it was in the wild. Yeah, it's wicked. Just at the side of the road. Like, only a small little dinky thing. Like, look, pretty much looks exactly like a hedgehog from the UK, but I, I suppose black with Little white tips. <laughs> yeah, it was really, really good. Really cool to see that. We've had such a good wildlife day, to be fair. Like, if we can see a koala now, that's really yeah. gonna like top it off. But we, we haven't even come for the wildlife. We've, I mean, we, we sort of wanted to see a koala, but to see a, to, to, to see the eagle, the echidna, oh my word, it's been absolutely insane. I saw a swamp wallaby as well on the side of the road, but obviously we're driving past, didn't film it. We've seen quite a few of them. Uh, we came for just a, like, a little tour of the Great Ocean Road. <laughs> like, it's been crazy. Yeah, madness. Is that your favourite thing? So far, yeah, my favourite thing by miles. <laughs> oh, that was unreal. I really was like, is that a hedgehog? It can't be a hedgehog, we're in Australia. That little blob there, <laughs> that's a koala. We found them. <laughs> For a good day search. Honestly. We found a koala. <laughs> found the little koalas in the trees. So we got two. Got one up in that tree. And there's one behind who was having a shout at Kate a minute ago. Yeah, I mean, you can't really see him at all. I'll try and have a little look, see, but... No, you can just... He's like... There, but I can literally just see his bum. 
They're uh, really hard to spot. That is quite hard. Like, if if we move this, like, here, you're looking in there, and there's one through here. Like, you won't see it. It's just a little blob, like, about there. You won't see it. It's really hard, isn't it? It's really so hard. Um, but it's well, well done you, though, for spotting it. Like, just, like, we got to about here. Okay, it looks up. Koali. Koali, that's an echidna and a koala bear. Yeah. This was supposed to be just like a, here's the Great Ocean Road and like, hope you enjoy this, but it's turned into a right wildlife expedition. It's been actually insane to be fair.